stablecoin is a cryptocurrency that attempts to peg its value to an external reference point, which in almost all cases is the US dollar. For this reason, when it comes to mediums of exchange, they're more useful than more volatile cryptocurrencies. For example, we all know that Tesla made the big song and dance about accepting Bitcoin as payment, but there is virtually no data on how many people actually bought a Tesla with Bitcoin, because that would be insane. But stablecoins are not without their own issues. Tether seems to be permanently at the center of controversy over what it may or may not have done or what it uses as collateral. And we all remember the wild collapse of Terra and its algorithmic stablecoin UST. Well, the SEC appears to be on the warpath and is planning to sue Paxos over BUSD, also known as Binance USD, for being an unregistered security. Rumors are also circulating that USDC, which BlackRock invested into, will soon receive an enforcement notice from the regulator too. But it's not all one-way traffic, and not every stablecoin project has fallen foul of the SEC. Reserve has had a pretty impressive few weeks. The Peter Thiel and Sam Altman back project has cut a lonely figure, sounding the alarm on algorithmic stablecoins for several years, while seemingly being overtaken by its gung-ho peers. But it may end up being the last man standing. Mobilecoin, the payment processor, just launched EUSD on the reserve platform, and the result has seen a surge in the price of RSR, reserve's native token. Reserve has put a lot of focus into being SEC compliant from day one, and the strategy may pay off in the long run.